Good afternoon. This is a cool little project I've been working on. Uh, it's a three tube transmitter for the neglected band. Um, it's built from a, an article from the popular, popular electronics magazine and um, the uh, three little tubes being a uh, 12, AT, 12 AU7, 12 uh, AT7 and a 6AQ5. Um, the neglected, neglected band is a portion of the 1750 meter band that was allocated back in the 50s for experimental use and uh, um, transmitting power of about one watt into a 50, si 50 foot antenna. Um, basically see how far uh, how far you can go when propagation's good. Um, now propagation for these long wavelengths um, are ground wave and uh, require very, very uh, efficient antennas and ground grounding uh, systems. Um, this uh, circuit slightly altered um, for a crystal. Uh, I put a uh, crystal between the plate and the grid on the 12AU7 and um, across the uh, 47k ohm I put a 22 um, or 220 picofarad capacitor and then a 220 picofarad capacitor between the uh, um, plate and ground so uh, that allows me to put use a any standard crystal and then um, also a uh, um, a capacitor in series with the plate and the uh, the crystal uh, the protective from the the DC voltage um, otherwise uh, it's a pretty standard circuit with a uh, modulation uh, choke and uh, two power transformers for 125 volts and um, that's about it um, currently, I'm working on the varometer uh, for the antenna. The antenna outside is a um, Marconi T uh, for right now, and then um, probably during the summer months, I'll uh, put up a uh, tower and um, make a, uh, a vertical with a capacity hat. Um, but uh, it was a cool little project and something nostalgic nostalgic for uh, for the era uh, the constructions on just a copper cladded board um, I have a uh, jack for audio input RF out um, and uh, this will also be the chassis for my medfer and hyfer which are medium frequency and um, high frequency experimental radio and uh, that that about does it for uh, for this uh, update. Thank you.